Welcome to Advanced City I. In this video, we are going to show you how our city traffic system operates in the center of Perak State, Ipo. This system has been implemented at the Jalan Sultan Idris Shah, involving four traffic junctions. Junction 1, Junction 2, Junction 3, and Junction 4. The journey time for the vehicles to travel from Junction 1 to Junction 4, took approximately 54 seconds. Advan City I's goal is to optimize the traffic flow on this road, to improve the driving experience while reducing traffic congestion. This goal has been successfully achieved through Advan City I traffic optimization. The traffic optimization process is divided into three phases. Phase 1. Data collection through Advan City I Clear Site AI CCTV, installed at every designated junctions, with the sole purpose to collect and monitor traffic data, which then will be transferred into the local traffic controller, and then stored in the Advan City I Cloud system. Then, SASKU will generate the timing plan and send it to the junctions for traffic optimization. ClearSight is a traffic video analytics on demand CCTV that is capable of generating and validating real-time details and insights on the city's traffic. Some of the features include vehicle classification, vehicle counting, waiting time calculation, journey time calculation, illegal maneuver detection, license plate recognition, incident detection, and vehicle tracking. After the data collection, that will bring us to phase 2 whereby the collected data will be used by artificial intelligence to generate traffic timing plans and choose the most suitable timing plan for each junction. The traffic timing plans will then be executed throughout phase 3, the implementation phase, where the green wave timing plans will be automatically executed at each junction. We are going to show you how our traffic optimization in phase 3 functions. Advan City I SASKU system, or also known as Step Adaptive, Split, Cycle, Offset Optimizer, made the traffic optimization process possible. SASKU enables the traffic junctions to continuously distribute green light time equitably for all traffic movements. To achieve this, SASKU utilized three steps before splitting the green light time to each respective junctions. First step that takes into consideration is the residual. Residual is the leftover vehicle that is stopped by the red lights. This enables SASKU to identify the volume of a vehicle in each lane. Higher vehicle volume or higher residual will lead SASKU to extend the green time, giving the congested lane more green light time. The second step that SASKU looks at is the queue. In this step, SASKU will monitor the volume of the vehicles before the traffic light turns green. If the volume of the vehicles are high, SASKU will open up the green light time much earlier. The third step is occupancy. Occupancy refers to the volume of vehicles moving inside the lane, giving SASKU the precise amount of time needed to transfer the available green light time which is not being utilized to the congested lane. From all these three steps, SASKU is able to continuously distribute and split green light time to the needed phase. With SASKU functioning, we can now see a green wave that gives more green light time from one junction to the other, hardly without any of the vehicles needed to stop giving a smoother traffic flow experience for the vehicles. For better user experience, Advanced City I traffic optimization process can be accessed via the Advanced City I web-based platform. All of the traffic data is stored inside this platform, enabling the users to monitor the traffic flow in real time. The users can also access the junctions that have been equipped with the Advanced City I traffic optimization, all with the accessibility to the clear sight AI CCTV real-time footage. The first graph is the vehicle classification graph, that counts and segregates different vehicles, in their own respective category. The origin destination chart displayed the precise amount of vehicles, traveling from one destination to another. The average journey time depicts two different data, the blue line represents Google traffic prediction, and the green line is the real-time data of the average journey time for the passing vehicles. The journey time graph shows the journey time recorded for each vehicle individually from one destination to another. This is made possible with our license plate recognition technology. From this platform, the users can monitor how the AI coordinate the green wave for the four junctions. Each junction turns on their green light consecutively, one by one. 
giving a smooth journey for the vehicles. With Advanced City Eye Traffic Optimization and SASQ, your cities can now reduce their traffic congestion while reducing the carbon emission caused by the congested vehicles. This is made possible with a truly smart traffic system, by Advanced City Eye. Your Smart City Solutions.